make sure you look smart. Name everything. You will need a blazer and a pea kit. Don't forget your coat for cold days. It shows to everyone that you go to the school. It gives you a sort of sense of shared identity, I think. Everyone's wearing the same thing, so you're all equal. I quite like it, I think it looks, you know, quite smart. And like everyone I know always says that's a really nice uniform. You're kind of part of their school, and then it, like you can say to them, oh, I'm coming from Cheney's school, I'm representing Cheney's school. I do feel quite proud walking, walking to school wearing the uniform. There is a good choice of food, both hot and cold. And you can get a free breakfast every day. You don't need to bring money. You can pay online and use your fingerprints. The canteen is brilliant. They have different ranges of food from hot to cold and big meals to little meals. You have a account which you can put money into from online or directly and then you have a thumbprint and you can just put your thumb on the sensor, it takes money from your account, you get to buy stuff. It's very straightforward. Be organised, use your plan to help you. Keep it safe and write in it neatly as it is important for the whole year. Make sure you do your homework as you'll get some every day. You can use the library as it's open to use after school. Well, the planner is a book that you can carry around to help you find your, your new lessons and your classes and to write in your homework. That's Without it, you kind of really have to keep everything in your head and you just like get lost and you're like, oh, do I need to do this or not? But with your planner, you can just be like, I've already done this, so I need to do this now. Definitely make it very neat because you're going to have to use it the whole term round and like always write your homework in it. Get to know your college. There are six colleges and every student is in one. You have a college area to use and an office to go to if you need anything. We have our tutor time and assemblies in colleges with the students from different year groups in them. We also play sport against the other colleges. The whole school is divided up into different colleges and then the, the colleges are divided into diff different tutor groups. And then between the tutors and the colleges, you sometimes have competitions. You could always ask your tutor for help for any, like literally anything. If you have a problem, like socially, you can always talk to the head or deputy of the college. Be on time for school and make sure you have everything you need for your school day, like your PE kit. Try and pack your bag the night before. In secondary school you've got to get to every lesson on time. I've usually got an alarm set so I wake up on time. There's a lot of responsibility, like in Woodfarm School they would give us everything over here. We have to take everything. If you have a PE kit or musical instrument you need to take in and have that ready. And I've done like my homework so I'm not rushing to do it in the morning. Make sure you join lots of clubs as they are free. You can try lots of new activities you have never done before. On Wednesdays you've only got one lesson on the on before between break and lunch, which means you can either go home early or attend one of the after school clubs. I did archery on the first half term and I've done debating ever since. Done rowing with Cheney Falcons, which is really fun. I'm about to get um, on the river and I do orchestra and the orchestra is very good here. You can also do like things like drama, trampolining, art, textiles and you, you just get to try like a range of different activities. Loads of people do it so you can meet people who like the same things as you. It's fun and it gives you skills that it's hard to learn in the classroom. Ask for help if you need it. You can always ask a teacher or the older kids as they are nice. There are also mentors who are older students who can help you if you need it. Everyone's got their own tutor group and they go to it 
for half an hour. Your tutor group, they'll help you a lot. Like, if you have any problems, you can ask them, they'll sort it out. We can ask our tutor anything if we needed any help. We can finish off our homework or we could just talk to friends. Older students help you out if you get lost or something, so that's good. Um, well, it's a little bit scary at first, but that's probably with any secondary school. But yeah, after like you get to know everybody, it's really friendly, and the teachers are always friendly. It's a locker. They're a good place to keep all your things, and it means you don't have to carry it with you everywhere. You won't forget your PE kit if you keep it at school. It's very useful having a locker because you can just leave your bag there and the stuff that you don't need. It's good to place to like just keep your PE kit. I often find that my bag's very heavy so I just put a lot of books in there which is really useful. Make new friends, talk to people you don't know. It may seem like a big place but you'll soon make lots of friends. You can meet them in your year area at clubs, tutor time or in inter-college activities. It's been a good experience making new friends. What you should do is try and make as many friends as possible so you can feel comfortable. We have like year areas where you could like mingle with other students and we have um, like lessons where we just do names and learn something about each other. I met loads of friends from archery and from debating and they often throw you into different mixes of lessons so you get to know a lot of people from a lot of different areas. It was really quick, you know, after the week I think I met so many new people that are now really close friends. Do your absolute best and make the most of your time at Cheney. There are lots of opportunities to choose and learn new things. Work hard and have fun. Think for yourself, act for others. You're not really nervous about anything here, it's just kind of easy flowing. You're just like, oh I have an exam, I need to revise. But then after the exam you're like, oh that was fine, I can do that again. I think it was just very well organised and it seemed quite a nice place to be. It's really good, a lot more independent than primary school. We have like a teacher who like specialises in like something rather than just having one teacher for everything. It means you get to know more about the subject. Obviously you can feel nervous because it's a massive step but besides that it's fantastic. I think it's because of the quality of the teaching here. They really help you understand the work you're doing. Just having a good time really and you know like appreciating that lessons are fun. I think I made a good choice coming here. It's been really enjoyable. Generally, if you think about school, you're like, oh, I want to stay home instead. But after you stay here for a while, you're like, I'm wasting my time at home. I just kind of want to go to school. Get involved with everything and try. Don't be shy. Don't worry, because there's like loads of people to help you. 